Hey T-Wolves, I'm Arnav Sood, your ASB Executive President, and today you'll be voting on your class officers for the 2021-2022 school year. Make sure you watch the speeches all the way through and then make an informed decision afterwards. And remember that these candidates who you're voting for will be setting the tone for in-person school next year when we're hopefully all back in person. Uh, one last thing, all of the candidates were required to film their speeches on their school laptops. So please do not judge the speeches based off their sound quality or video quality because the candidates had no control over that, but judge them based off what they're actually saying and how they're saying it. So that's all I have for you. And without further ado, we can move right into speeches. Up first for junior class president, we have Phoebe Hong. Hey juniors, my name is Phoebe Hong and I'm here running to be your next class president. Going into our next school year, our senior year is way too important to be having leaders who won't prioritize you and won't put in the maximum amount of effort needed to make things happen. That's why I'm here to truly initiate change and to start new traditions right here at Jackson. And instead of just saying I have a great work ethic or that I get things done, you guys can see examples of my work and my words put into action all around our school. In my previous campaign, I promised to bring you guys a student-led newspaper. And in the span of only a couple months, with the help of a friend, I planned, proposed, and started Jackson's own newspaper club for the first time in nearly 20 years. All this goes to show that I'm not someone who'll just sit here and make empty promises that I won't keep. I'm the type of person who'll always go the extra mile and make sure to get things done and to always listen to you guys. Some of the other responsibilities of this president position includes organizing our senior prom, senior sunrise, assemblies, and other class bonding events. With me leading our senior class as president, you can rest assured that not only will these events all be insanely fun and engaging, but they'll be as inclusive as it can get as my number one priority going into our next school year is to bond as a class, which is something we've all been missing out due to remote learning. My hope is that with me in office, by our graduation night, we'll all feel as close and connected to our class as it can get. So vote me as your class president if all these exciting ideas sound too good to be true, because they can happen with the right leaders and the right changes made. Vote me if you're ready to start our own traditions and have the best senior year ever. Vote me, Phoebe Hong, as your class president, and let's see some change happen next year. Running against Phoebe for class president is Munder Abukter. Hey Jackson, I'm Munder Abukter, and I'm running to represent you as your class president. Senior year is the year we've all been waiting for. The year where strong leadership and teamwork in ASB is crucial. The year of our prom and the final quarter of our high school years experience to represent our class and the dedication needed to do so efficiently will be the determining factor in how special this upcoming year will be. Through my participation during the past three years in ASB as both your VP and president, I have gained valuable insight into what it takes to be a leader and make this last year the best one yet. Throughout clubs and different school activities, I've also been given the privilege to see where ASB can better the school and the best opportunities and events to build class unity. Although I am a current ASB member, my connections with all different types of students enables me to think and see things in everybody's perspective. I have a clear vision to make our last year and prom at Jackson better than any one of us could even imagine. I've connected with every type of student and have proven I am not only capable, but excel in representing you. I trust your vote is in Munder Bookter for the last time as class of 2022 president. Thank you and have a great day, T-Wolves. Up first for class vice president, we have Hunter Meyer. What's up, juniors? My name is Hunter Meyer and I'm running to be your next class vice president. Coming in every year full of Zoom classes, it's now time to start thinking about our next full year back at school and how to make our last year in high school the best it can possibly be. We've collectively experienced our junior year over computer screens and although now just some of us are starting to go back to school, it's not at all how we imagine our final two years would be. For this reason, I've committed my campaign to turning past upkept promises into reality. My name is Hunter Meyer, and I'm running to be your next class vice president, because you deserve better. You deserve strong leadership with vision, passion, and self-determination. How many times have you been promised something just to receive no action? Everything ranging from school events, clubs, and assemblies should be catered to the interests and requests of the students not for our own personal agenda. 
As your candidate for Class 5 President, I will work alongside the President and promise to lead the student government so that it benefits the entirety of our senior class. My involvement in the greater community beyond the school, such as volunteering at food banks and being an active member in the service committee, shows that I have the experience and the passion to handle the prestigious role of being your senior class vice president. Because of this, I will strive to do my best and I will always listen to your ideas, concerns, and suggestions. So if you are determined to make this year the best, just remember this. Vote Hunter Meyer, senior class vice president, the better option for a better year. Also running for class vice president is April Lee. Hey Timberwolves, it's been a tough year and I'm sure we can all agree that COVID has made this year less than what it could have been. With sports being delayed or canceled, clubs being online, and social interaction for everyone being limited. We have all been put through so much, but we can't give up here. We have to shed the helplessness that COVID has imposed upon us and take control of the precious 2022 school year. My name is April Lee, and I'm running to be your next class vice president. If I take office, I will implement my ideas to make Jackson the best it can be. Ideas that will reach different students with different interests. Ideas that will push the boundaries of what is possible for Jackson students. It is clear that us students of Jackson are incredibly diverse and unique in terms of interests, goals, and needs. Our own individuality is what makes us so great as a community, and we should embrace that. School art exhibitions, music concerts, or TED Talk nights would help Jackson support its students with the chances to pursue what they love, rewarding and showcasing the skills they learn. But I don't want just my ideas. I want yours too, because who knows what you want better than yourself. I value your wants, needs, and suggestions, and I promise to do as much as I can to make them become a reality. I also want to create the best and warmest environment at our school. I want people to feel involved and hyped at school by implementing more events such as more class competitions, parties, color runs, drive-in movie nights, and of course, all the other ideas that you guys have. Finally, I want to help Jackson bounce back from COVID better than ever before, especially because it's our last year here. But influencing the direction of the school is going to require commitment, ingenuity, and leadership, all of which I can provide. I have the drive, the passion, the ideas, and the spirit needed to serve your interests and shape next year to fit your expectations. Trust me, I have a lot of spirit and energy for somebody who's 5'1". Vote April Lee as your senior class vice president. And remember, we're all in this together. Thank you. Up first for junior class secretary is Juliana Davis. Hello, my name is Juliana Davis and I'm running for senior class secretary. Let me introduce you to the role of a secretary here at ASB and why I would be a great fit. Being given the position of secretary entails taking a lot of notes. The reason that I am most qualified for this role is because I'm very attentive and organized. I will be able to write down important points in each meeting. What gives me an advantage is that I can type up to 100 plus words per minute with few to no errors, so the notes that I take are guaranteed to be efficient and accurate. Another role of the secretary is to create PowerPoints for Congress. I'm well versed in making a variety of PowerPoints, whether it be for a club that I'm involved in or for school presentations. I love art and design, so you can expect me to give plenty of attention to detail, making Congress presentations very fun and eye-catching while still providing the necessary information. The last thing that a secretary is expected to do is participate in ASB discussions. I believe that I'm very creative and will bring good ideas to the table, no matter the subject. I strongly believe that each student's voice matters. If I am elected, I will periodically put up polls in my social media pages and talk with students regarding subjects relating to the ASB, such as what theme they might like for senior prom. When I participate in these discussions, I will be sure to tell ASB about all of the answers that I've received. Your voice matters, and I would love to make the connection between your ideas and ASB easier to achieve. Overall, I'm grateful for the opportunity to run as secretary, and if I'm elected, I will do my best to make each person's high school experience more enjoyable. I believe that I am a good fit and a wise choice for this position. So remember, vote for Juliana Davis for senior class secretary for efficient notes, engaging presentations, and a greater chance for your voice and ideas to be heard. Up against Juliana is Cody Carr. Hey Timberwolves, my name is Cody Carr, and I am ranked to be your next year's senior class secretary. The time has finally come. As we end our junior year in uncertain times, we turn the page to the best and final year of our high school journey, senior year. In this position, results matter. And I won't stand here and lie to you and say ridiculous promises that have no genuine importance nor can be realistically fulfilled. But what I can do is promise that when needed, my ears will be open to hearing your struggles. My ears will be open to hearing your ideas to make our senior year the best year it can be. I do not care who you are or what you choose to believe in. 
I will listen to you and respect you no matter what. I work well in a team. I bring new perspectives to the table, and I know what it takes to be a class secretary. And even though I am running for class secretary, my plans for ASB go well beyond just note-taking and making presentations. From working with Link Crew to volunteering in Key Club, I know my community, and I want to share the same enthusiasm with you guys by making more senior events, making prom the best it could be, and listening to your guys' concerns. Your voices and your ideas will define our senior year. As your next class secretary, I will continue to strive to work hard for you, to better our community, and to make our senior year the best it can be. So when you look at those ballots and you're thinking of who to vote for, just remember to vote for the best candidate for this job. And I trust that you guys will make the right decision. Vote the real choice for real change. Vote Cody Carr for senior class secretary. For junior class treasurer, your only candidate is Christian Flynn. What's up, juniors? I'm Christian Flynn, and I'm going to be your treasurer for the fourth year in a row, no matter what happens. I'll continue to work to raise funds to make our problem the best it can possibly be. And as always, you can hit me up if you have questions, ideas, or just want to talk. Our senior year is about to be way after Corona chills out, and I will do my part to make sure that we get a great senior year. Thank you for trusting with your money yet again. For activities coordinator, up first, we have Andra Dirtu. Class of 2022, it's time. Right now is when you guys decide what kind of senior year we're going to have. I'm Andre Dirtu, we're junior class activities coordinator, and here's why re-electing me is our best bet for what could be our best year. With your votes from last year, I spent my time in ASB wisely, asking the questions and taking notes to make sure you guys don't get another mediocre year. I've studied the patterns of previous senior ASBs as well as our classes. I know our shortcomings, I know where in the planning process things fall apart, or why promises seem to disappear after elections. And I know you might be thinking, what about a fresh perspective? What about changing AC from the outside? The fact of the matter is, if somebody doesn't have that groundwork, they can't aim high. If you don't know where the bar is, you can't raise it. I'm warmed up and ready to hit the ground running next year. After losing so much time, here's what you guys deserve. You deserve bonfires and drive-ins. You deserve scavenger hunts and escape rooms. You deserve prom, tallow, and a winter ball. You deserve new traditions, like senior picnics, carnivals, like adopting a freshman, like West Coast Battle of the Bands, and so much I can't even fit in. But we've all sat through so many elections by this point and have the same campaign jargon thrown at us, it probably feels like the same person is running year in, year out. And I'm not here with those same empty promises, because we simply just don't have the time for that. Now let me take a step back. We've all heard this a million times. But we did miss out on a lot, and trying to fit three years worth of memories into one Sounds overwhelming and a little idealistic, but the opportunity is here, and we have no time to waste. So sit back, enjoy the ride, next one's on me. I'm Audrey Dirtu, your junior class activities coordinator. I've got your bag. Do I have your vote? It's go time, T-Wolves. Running against Andra for class activities coordinator is Philip Shin. Timberwolves, let's face it. We only have one more left of high school, and there's no time to waste it. It's not our only chance to elect a real candidate. My name is Philip Shin, and I'm running to be your next class activities coordinator, because it's finally time to be a real candidate who can bring real results to our community. I value the importance of strong leadership because it doesn't matter how effective a group of students can be if there's no one to point them in the right direction. Because of this, I will strive to be the best and I will listen to your ideas, concerns, and suggestions. Taking on the role of activities coordinator requires a lot of dedication to have a positive student body. But something is lacking in our ASB. Honesty. In the last three years of our high school journey, time and time again, we see people making promises that cannot be realistically achieved. That is why I want to make realistic promises for our senior year. Ensuring prom to be a special night that we would never forget, bringing back macho volleyball and powder puff, and creating safe spaces for all of our students. If I win, this will be my first year in ASB, and that is a good thing for our school, because we need new perspectives and new ideas. The last normal year we have is freshman year, so we need to end our senior year with fun events and lasting memories. As your next class activities coordinator, I will never let you down and I will promise you that I will work for you, I will listen to you, and I will stand up for you. So when you're thinking of who to vote for, Make sure to vote for somebody who is determined to make our senior year the best it can be. Vote Philip Shin for Class Activities Coordinator. Thank you. Those are all of the candidates for all five positions, and so now it's officially time to vote. 
Your teachers should be providing you with a link to vote for the candidates who you feel like are most deserving of winning. So please vote and make sure to not factor in the sound quality or video quality of the speeches because once again, the candidates had no control over that. That's all I have for you today, T-Wolves. Make sure to stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll catch you all later.